All right, so Leo, we're going to have a look and see what's going to come out for you. And now keep in mind that this will not resonate for every single Leo. All right. If you like a personal reading, that'll be the first link in the description down below. All right, go ahead and click on that if you want that. Um, another thing you do is we also have a website, right, for you to check things out. You know, like there's things for sale. Okay. And if you like joining to the channel, feel free to do so. Okay, Leo, what I feel like for you, you got love here, Leo. Who is this person with? I don't know, but it's like, you know, you get, like, butterflies with this person. <laughs> oh, goodness. There could be a re- I feel a couple things for you, Leo. I feel like there's gonna be a reunion. A little lover, but I also feel like new love. Okay? If you're already with someone, the reading's probably not for you. Like, this message here is not for you. Um, but that is what I feel. Okay? So... They might be the same sign, like the same zodiac sign here as well, Leo. These lovers. Or something about them that's similar. Maybe like one's older, one's older, or one's older, one's younger. Alright, so let's just shuffle these cards. What's happening for the sign of Leo? I see you being more focused on yourself here, Leo, okay? I see you being more focused on your appearance. I see you being more focused on your money, you know, your life, your... That's where your focus is. Maybe thinking about it a little too much, but it's not really bad. You understand? There's worse things that you could be doing. Um, there could also be an earth sign who's very in their head about you, like thinking about you a little too much. Splitting the deck, we have the Queen of Pentacles, which is earth. The Eight of Swords. Yeah, you have someone here missing you. Alright. Leo. Oh dear. Now we have the Knight of Swords. Five of Cups. We have the King of Swords, which is air. So we have Earth and Air being presented here. Leo. I was wanting to say Virgo for some reason. Either way, Earth and Air. We have the Knight of Cups. We have the Wheel of Fortune. We have the Four of Swords. We have the Six of Swords. We have the Page of Pentacles. You have Seven of Cups, Three of Swords, Ten of Swords, hold on, anyways, the Ten of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Seven of Swords, We have the Eight of Pentacles, Three of Wands, Seven of Pentacles with the Emperor, the Emperor being Aries here, okay? So, Leo, first off, I see your business about to be doing well, I see your money about to be doing well, Leo. That area of your life is going to be improving a lot here, okay? Um, now as far as this person goes, big no. Like, yeah, I see them missing you. I do see them trying to re reappear back into your life, but it feels like... 
there's a lot of things that they've been doing that you, you probably don't want to know about, okay? Even if you know some things, there's more going on that they, they did. Okay, I feel like there there may have been other people that they were involved with. It just isn't a good picture, Leo. Alright. I see you having other options, too. Like I said, I see you someone newer. Alright. It's either someone younger than who you're dealing with or someone older, but it feels like out of the same zodiac sign. Okay. <laughs> but either way, that is what I see for you. Alright, so let's see some some messages and advice here, Leo. We have intervention. I want you to learn from your choices, but I I always protect you from consequences that will not benefit your soul development. When my intervention is required, it is given. Fear not. Okay, look at this. You have spirit intervening here. Okay? Between you and this person. Because, like I said, something there was not right. So... Definitely does feel like it feels like you have the divine, you have your angels, okay? But you also may have like someone who's passed on who's intervening here. There's a lot of intervention happening here, Leo. I think that's why you're being sent new love. You're gonna click with the new love anyways, it's just gonna be like a click, Leo. You understand? It's not gonna be like, you know, I don't like this person. <laughs> get them away from it. It's just going to be like an instant click with the new love. Like, bam. You understand? I see new love progressing very fast for you. Like, if you were to get in a relationship, I see that being very fast. It's not going to be one of those slow ones. It's going to be something like fast. So fast progression in that relationship. Okay? You can even, like, get married in the same year. You understand? Like, that kind of fast progression. So... What is this? Number 19 with the Holy Sisters. Now we're going to have to look at the book here because I, I don't really know this deck a whole lot. This is a very cool deck, however. So let's see. What's, what's this? 747 Leo. What's happening here with this card? I am bringing you the blessings of sacred connection and kindred spirits. You have the power to help others and are worthy of being helped too. You are a keeper of wisdom of the heart, and you understand that there is no need for the competition or comparison. There is more than enough for all to experience an abundance of blessing. You know that when true spiritual success comes for one, the resources available for all only increase. Enjoy the sacred connections that I am sending your way. Nourish and be nourished as you gather in my name. Look at this. Okay. So you're being sent. Like I, like I said, it feels like new love's being sent to you. That's it. You have this intervention here, like Leo. Okay. And you're also being sent wealth. Okay. You're being sent like a lot of good things in your life. All right. There's no need to worry. There's no need to be jealous. There's no need, you know. Good tidings. It says in a reading. Forgive, release, let go. Allow your relationship to be changed if it needs to be. Letting go allows you to open up to the new. Have a connection. Re have you made a connection recently that feels like a deep soul connection? It is. See, like I said, you're going to be clicking with a new person. You know, it's like an instant click. Click, click. <laughs> Trust in the deeper feelings you have about your connections to others. Seek out friends who nurture your soul. It is wise to be careful of connections that drain or depress you. Feeding dysfunctional connections is not a good and helpful way of good and helpful use of your time and energy. New people and connections are coming into your world, like I said. Seek out connection. This is all before I was even like looking at your cards, Leo. You remember that? You remember I want you to think about that. Like this lady talking about what's coming into my life before even looking at these cards. Okay, I want you to put that there. Okay, and I want you to get a personal reading. <laughs> I'm kidding. But either way, um, 
Where was I? Seek out connections that are mutually <laughs> beneficial for collaboration and to expand your loving field of presence and influence. Have you felt isolated or lacking in genuine support? The oracle indicates this will change. Open your heart and mind to a new reality of loving connections. Okay. See? See what we were talking about here, Leo. Okay. butterfly feeling it wasn't from the past because I don't really feel like you feel I don't really feel like you feel a lot of love for the past connection if I'm honest Leo I see you like falling head over heels for someone newer all right and it's that same mutual feeling okay uh, we have number three blossoms from the sky dancer making sure you see that Okay, 1116. Maybe that's of significance here. I didn't see numbers, and if it's like really drawn to me, I'll say them, especially if it's like a, a, a synchronicity number. If it's just like numbers, I don't know. It all has a reason here. We have Kuan Yin dances creative energy and light across the sky, causing blossoms to descend in the same way. When we tap into our spiritual power of creation, I'm about to sneeze. We cause our life and all life around us to bloom. Creation is a natural spiritual power within you, beloved. Force can slow down, uh, slow down the process. It's time to stop striving and to allow your manifestation to occur. Trust, let go, and allow your creation to flow. Leo, yes. Okay. You need to trust. Okay, don't try to force it. Don't try to, you know, this, this, that, that didn't happen. Okay, Leo. You are already manifesting it. And prayer. Beloved Kuan Yin, Sky Dancer, blossoming with creation, I am one with the power of the Divine Feminine. I am one with peace, with creation that will manifest. I am love, I am surrendering, I am yin, I am blessed. I let go to receive. I let go to flow. Peace in my heart now fertilizes my creation to grow. Okay, that was a prayer. So, like I said before, if you want a personal reading, that will be the first link in the description down below. Okay, Leo. And if you want to see more content, don't forget to like subscribe, okay? Because that that is something that actually helps. Uh, I will see you all later.